Curious Gomo. Hey there, Wupa. What are you up to? You're planting some tomato seeds? I hope his tomatoes grow tall and strong. Huh? Oh no, the leaves have wilted. What are we going to do? It doesn't seem like it'll rain for a while. Wow, you made the clouds smaller. <laughs> the cloud is pouring rain on the tomato plants. <laughs> Doesn't it seem like the cloud got even smaller? It got bigger after spraying some water. <laughs> <laughs> wow, look at those delicious looking tomatoes. <laughs> this is all thanks to the rain cloud. Thank you, rain cloud. <laughs> I think it's time to send the rain cloud back into the skies. Cloud, let's meet again soon. Today we explored a rain cloud together with Gomo. There are a lot of different kinds of clouds in the sky. But what exactly are clouds made of? The answer is water. Clouds are made of tiny droplets of water that are grouped together. When there are too many droplets, some of them fall back to the ground as rain. Sometimes clouds can make electricity, and we call this lightning. When there's lightning, there's a risk of getting shocked by it, so make sure you all get inside where it's safe. Until next time, stay curious, curious! Wow, what a beautiful underwater world we're in! What's inside this chest we found at the bottom of the ocean? Could it be a treasure chest? Hmm, but it's locked with a locket. How are we going to open it? Uh, 
It's a really strong chest. Aha! Uh -huh, we found the key! I hope this is the right key. Well, it opened! Is there really treasure inside it? Oh! There's another chest inside the chest. And this chest has a lock on it as well. How are we going to get this chest open? I don't see a key anywhere either. What's that? Six eight zero one. Could it be the code for the lock? Six eight zero one. I'll send. Will the lock open finally? Oh no, that must be the wrong code. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We were almost sure it was 6801. What do our friends think? Oh. Mm -hmm. 1089? <gasps> Why does the number look different? Aha! Uh -huh. The paper was upside down. The passcode was 1089. Okay, let's check to see if it works. 1089. Wow! The padlock opened! I hope there's not another chest inside the chest. Wow! It's treasure! It really was a treasure chest! <laughs> Congrats, Gomo! But hey, you think you can share some of that with me as well? Huh? Today we explored a lock together with Gomo. A lock is a device used to lock something so that it doesn't open. Locks are usually made of metal, so it's really tough and strong. You can't open locks without a key or a passcode number. So you should always keep the keys in a safe place and always remember the passcode. Alrighty then, little friends. Until next time, stay curious curious.